TCP IP isn't a single protocol. It's a series of protocols. It's based on a four-layer model similar to the OSI model. However, before you learn more about the layers, you should better understand IP, TCP, and UDP. HIP Internet Protocol HIP, defines an IP address as four 8-bit numbers called octets. It also is a network layer protocol that delivers packets from one computer to the next. TCP Transmission Control Protocol TCP, is a transport layer protocol. It makes sure that packets are delivered safely when sent to a device on the same or different network. If the packet wasn't properly delivered, it resends it. TCP is when a single device wants to give data to another device. It's not used for sending data to several devices simultaneously. UDP are used instead for this method. UDP User Datagram Protocol UDP, is also a transport layer protocol. But unlike TCP, it doesn't require a connection, and it doesn't worry about sending packets to the correct destination. For example, when UDP sends a packet, it ignores it afterward until it gets a reply. If a reply doesn't return, it either resends the packet or gives up. However, UDP is faster and uses fewer resources than TCP. TCP IP layers As said before, the TCP IP layers match the OSI model. The network interface layer corresponds to the physical and data link layers. Both of the network and transport layers match, and TCP IP application layer corresponds to the upper three layers of the model. Network interface layer. This layer corresponds with OSI physical and data link layers. It focuses on how data is physically sent through the same network via two devices. The protocols used by this layer are Ethernet, Token Ring, FDDI, X.25, Frame Relay. This layer is called the Internet layer. It must send packets from any network and computer to their destination, regardless of its route. Here are the IP protocols that operate here. Internet Protocol IP Address Resolution Protocol ARP Internet Control Message Protocol ICOM Internet Group Management Protocol ING Transport Layer This layer makes sure that data is delivered securely over the network. It also builds on the network layer and prepares data for the application layer. The transport layer ensures that all messages or packets are delivered to their destination without errors, or else it would be resubmitted. The protocols here are Transmission Control Protocol TCP, User Datagram Protocol UDP, Application Layer. This layer allows end users to interact and communicate with applications. It also provides email services. The most popular application layer protocols are Hypertext Transfer Protocol HTTP, File Transfer Protocol FTP, Telnet, Simple Mail Transfer Protocol SMTP, Domain Name System DNS. Lesson Summary Internet Protocol IP is a network layer protocol that delivers packets from one computer to the next. Transmission Control Protocol TCP makes sure that packets are delivered safely when sent to a device on the same or different network. User Datagram Protocol UDP sends a packet, it ignores it afterward until it gets a reply. If a reply doesn't return, it either resends the packet or gives up. As said before, the TCP IP layers match the OSI model. The interface layer focuses on how data is physically sent through the same network via two devices. The network layer's duty is to send packets from any network and computer to their destination, regardless of its route. The transport layer makes sure that data is delivered securely over the network. The application layer allows end-users to interact and communicate with applications.